as the track track project continues i need a pcb to let me get the inputs from the handlebars into the control box where i can both forward them onto the electronic speed controllers and get them into one arduino that can look at the state of the system it was designed spark to create the schematic got a pcb design with all the inputs on that i need and then use flat cam to create g-code for my cnc router which is what i'm going to use to create the pcb got a blank onto a piece of sacrificial board screwed it down bolted the workpiece onto the cnc router bed and the cnc router as usual milled drilled and cut out the edges of the tracks are a bit rough and i usually get better results than this not quite sure because i did everything that i normally do thought i'd better double check the milling bit and yeah it had broken not the sharpest tool in the box this pcb has got a lot of connectors on it and I really like a silk screen, but obviously I can't really do that with a CNC router. But then I thought, would I be able to use a laser cutter to do it? I exported the silk screen and loaded it up into Lightburn where I isolated the board outline. And I'm going to use this to burn onto a piece of scrap that I can then use to align the PCB on the laser cutter bed. And this little rectangle burned onto the scrap was all I needed to get everything lined up. Then I ran the laser cutter, quite a fast speed, quite high power. I wish I'd uh, done a few tests before I tried this because it didn't really come out brilliantly, but it wasn't a disaster. Um, but it sort of worked, yeah. And then I did what I really should have done first. I tried some different power and speeds. This is a higher power and a slower speed and it's just destroyed it. Absolutely useless. But with a much slower cutting speed and a much lower power, it didn't actually turn out too bad. Would I use this technique again? Well, yeah, I think I probably would, actually. I'm sure I can get the resolution up a little bit. I think maybe the text was a bit small, too. It was only about 1.3 millimetres. But, yeah, I'd try it again. Thanks for watching.